Tucked 53 kilometers from Malindi town, Kamali village stands out from other villages due to the presence of an all-weather road, electricity and piped water. The only landmark at the shopping center is a telecommunication mast and the signpost of Kamale Primary School. The village known to many as Kamale is the home village of the now Senate Speaker Amazon Kingi. We toured the village and met Kingi's father, Bwana Kingi Marua Mukweha. Nimemza mtoto anaitwa Amazon Jefa Kingi. Kingi was recently elected Speaker of the Senate after scooping all the 46 cast ballots by senators allied to Kenya Kwanza and Azimio Laumoja won Kenya political outfits. Kingi's father, 82 years old Kingi Mwarua Mukweha, said he followed the Senate proceedings that culminated in his son getting the coveted seat. And when his son was elected Speaker of the Senate, the whole house was filled with joy as they wailed in happiness. Sasa, amepata kibarua, ni Speaker wa Senator. Hiyo yangu ni shukurani kubwa sana. Toto wangu kupata kazi hiyo ya serikali. Na furaha na mungu amrehemu azili kuendelea. Hiyo ni furaha kubwa kwangu. Kingi's father narrated that challenges at hand made him send his son and some of his siblings to Kambi Yawaya area where they stayed with relatives and completed their primary school education. Nimemsomesha shule ya Kamale. Kakuwa na matatizo kama shifta, nikamuondoa, nikaenda naye Kambi Yawaya. Akaenda kusomea hapo mpaka akamaliza masomo yake. Maisha yake niliishi naye shida shida aziachi nyumbani kwa sababu ya mambo ya chakula. Mara nimefukuzwa na mashifta. Ile school fees na nyang'anywa. Lakini sikujali mimi. Nakimbia tu naingia kichakani. Alafu wakienda wale majangili mimi na, 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 natoka nje. Natafuta karo za shule paka akamaliza. Singi sikurudi nyuma, nilikuwa shujaa kama yeye alivyo nishujaa. Kwa hivyo hiyo yangu nishukurani Mungu alinisaidia sana. Paka mtoto amefika hapa. He added that Kingi is the seventh born of his first wife and he has at least 41 children from five wives although some of them passed on. Yule katika umbo lake kwa mama yake ni mimba ya saba kuna wengine ambao ni wakubwa zake na yule ni wa saba wengine wamepita lakini yeye katika kwa mama yake ni mimba ya saba nimemzaa mwaka wa sabini mwezi wa tisa Mwarua Mukweha said that Kingi and his siblings have helped him live a dignified life in the remote village that is prone to drought and hunger. Tulienzi mambo yetu mazuri hata kwa location hii yetu watu wengi wana sifu sana hapa nyumbani kwa maendeleo yangu. Eh, napata wageni kila mara hapa mzee tusaidie na hili kwa mawazo. Yule mtu ambaye ana anakashishi na ana shule hata ikusomesha mtoto mimi na mwe, mpa muongozo anaendelea vizuri mtoto anafaulu anakuja mwenyewe anasema basi ule muongozo wako mzee ulionipatia na mimi sasa najivunia honorable king briefly practiced law in mombasa town before venturing into politics in 2007 under the orange democratic movement party and he became magarini member of parliament in the grand coalition government formed by president mwekibaki and prime minister raila odinga he was appointed Minister for East Africa Community and later Fisheries and when devolution came into being, he became the first governor of Kilifi County. Kingi served his two terms under ODM before forming his political party, the Pamoja African Alliance Party, PA, which he used to bargain with Kenya Kwanza Coalition led by President-elect William Ruto in the run-up to the August 9th general election. His mother, Bahati Nzovu, was not around during the interview. Kindo Stefano, Ebru TV.